What is up guys? Juno Sloth here and welcome to the next episode in this Titan Push series. So we found this guy here worth quite a few trophies and if we look in the centre you'll see that both of his air sweepers are pointed to the right. So the obvious choice is to attack from the left because it is quite a symmetrical base as well. So I've spread out my lava hounds and I have lines of balloons from either side behind them coming in and then my clan castle balloons in the centre of that. Minions go in and then I put my rage spells in just to get through them initial line of defences. And then since we don't have to worry about the air sweepers, my freeze is going to be used for the multi infernos. The one at the bottom there you'll see I got the expo and the tesla alongside that. I then have my next rage to push my balloons over the core. And in this situation it's good to hold on to that last freeze so you can get that multi inferno and allow the minions to power through the town hall which they just nip it in this case giving me the two star before I've even deployed my heroes. So I've got one minion down there taking that dark elixir storage so I'm just going to deploy them on the top for a little bit of extra loot. Once that's done I'll end the battle and finish the raid with 16 trophies. So I've certainly found that now when I'm in the clouds it does take longer to get a raid. Certainly when you're this high in trophies and there's not as many people for the matchmaking to find you, every once in a while when you're searching you will get this message. Not to worry, you just have to keep plugging away because eventually you might find someone like this. And no, your eyes are not deceiving you. This guy is worth 57 trophies and only a minus one for a loss. It's a no-brainer. We are going to attack. So if we switch across to the replay and look at this guy's base, I decided to attack from the top right. No particular reason because it's quite a symmetrical base. That's just where I chose to come from. I mean, if you can attack from behind one of the air sweepers, you've obviously only got one to deal with. And I'm going to use one of my free spells to prevent the other one pushing any of my balloons back because I want them to use that rage spell and get over the core as quickly as possible. So it's looking good at this point and a lot of troops are starting to get over towards the town hall. I've held off with that freeze until the minions are a bit closer and hopefully now they can get in and make a push for that town hall. Now you can see that my troops are starting to wear a bit thin. I'm at 47% and I do have a couple of minions left over to try and snipe a couple of buildings. The only one I can see at this point is that builder's hut over there so I'll put one minion in. And that's going to leave me at 49%. Then I'm going to make a push for the town hall with my heroes because even if I press the queen's cloak she should be able to get it. So you'll see where my clan castle deployment is at the top there. That is generally a good position to put your heroes in after a Lavalunian attack. Or the way that I do it anyway, because I bring my balloons in from either side and use my castle balloons in the centre. And the reason I do that is because you'll have heard me say in previous videos that you want your balloons to space out onto the defences as they're getting tanked by the Lava Hounds. And obviously you can't do that with a clan castle. So I put them in to reinforce damage over the core and the town hall. So you'll see we put our queen in after the king as we have been. She got through and got the town hall for an amazing 38 trophies. Alright, so heading back to base we are on 4,202 trophies. That is our new personal best and 100 trophies over the requirement for Titan. So if we pop across over to the leaderboards and see how we're doing. We'll first look at global here. We were inside the top 10,000 at the end of last episode and we finished this one 8,689th. Not too bad and if we pop across to GB we must be getting closer. We've climbed quite a few trophies there with that wheel. 203rd. We are only 12 trophies off. Join me next time where we make a push to the top 200. This has been Judo Sloth. Peace out. Yeah.